All right, so I just wanted to do a quick video showing how to upgrade or change the hard drive on this Lenovo G550. Um, so this is just a very quick video, but anyways, you're going to want a PH or a J1 screwdriver, and you'll have to remove the two screws here and the one screw here to get to the RAM. And if you want to get to the hard drive, you remove the two screws here. So I'm going to be upgrading this computer to an SSD, so that's why I'm doing this video. All right, so first what you want to do uh, to get to the RAM, undo those three screws. After that, you can get under here with a pry tool or your fingernail, and then pull this up, okay? Once you get that, you kind of want to wiggle this while you're kind of pulling it, and it should come out just like that. All right, so underneath here, you'll see the sticks of RAM. There's two sticks of RAM. Let me zoom in on that for you. All right, so to remove the RAM, what you do, you just pull these two tabs to the side. The stick of RAM will pop up at an angle like that. I don't know why, but this stick of RAM is really difficult to pull out, but usually once it pops up like that, you kind of just pull it back and it will come out. So this is PC38500S. So if you need to upgrade your RAM, sorry, it's going out of view. If you need to upgrade your RAM, that's what you'd get. You can probably upgrade it to eight gigs, possibly even 16 gigs, uh, but you probably don't need more than eight gigs for most people. Anyways, to put it back, you just put it back at this angle and then make sure that you push it back all the way. For some reason, this slot is very stubborn. Usually it should be pretty easy to pull it out and put it back in if you have it at the right angle but that's how you do it and then just clip this back down there are the dc jack and stuff but i'm not going to go over that uh basically to remove the dc jack you just pull this thing up you might have to use the cable and wiggle it and pull it uh this one it's usually known to be very stubborn you also got the wireless card which is very similar to all the wireless cards on every other laptop I've worked on so if you want to see that um, you can watch those other videos but basically you pull up on the tail of the antennas and it will pop out all right I believe this is the oops can you even see this is the LVDS cable and I think this is the fan cable but yeah anyways this is just mainly a RAM and hard drive video you don't need to remove the battery if you are going to be doing this just make sure your computer's off okay so to do the hard drive, just undo the two screws, then you can pop this up, okay, just like that. Just pull up on this, you might have to kind of wiggle it around a little bit. Then you got this, there's a little clear pull tab, you can just pull this back. If the tab is broken or missing, what you can do is just use this metal bracket wherever you can get a hold of it, and then just pull it back just like that. Okay, so this is a two and a half inch SATA hard drive, if you want to upgrade it to an SSD. I have a video on how you can clone the hard drive to an SSD. If you can't find it, just post a comment below and I will send you a link for that. But anyways, to upgrade it, you just want to take the four screws out. Let me see how large is this. This is only 250 gigs, so I'm probably going to just put a 240 gig SSD in here. But yeah, remove the four screws and then you basically just move this bracket over to the SSD. Okay, so very simple. And then to put it back in, just do the reverse, slide the hard drive back in place, and you're good to go. So hopefully this video helped you. I mean, it's very simple. Uh, I think anyone, hopefully anyone could be able to figure out most of this. But if not, yeah, just leave a comment below. I'll see what I can do. But yeah, make sure you watch the video first before asking questions. All right, thanks for watching. Again, hopefully it helped. If it did, please like and subscribe because that'll help others find this video. And thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Uh, bye.